but you know, you know I gotta end it with a bash, man. I gotta, everywhere I go, I'm gonna make sure I do a video where you guys gonna see a beauty, a beautiful part of Peru. So we're gonna end it with a bash, and this is what I'm gonna show you, man. This is where a dope spot to come and chill, have drinks, dance with a chick, whatever you want. So I'm gonna just show you guys around, man. I'm gonna let you guys see it from behind right quick. This is where we at. See it? You see it? You see it? Keep looking. You see it? You see it? Boom. You see it, man. This thing is looking. This thing is looking super beautiful right here, man. So it's not even about it's not even about where we at. It's the whole scenery. To me, the whole scenery is dope. It's like. I don't know, I can't even explain it, you know what I mean? What's up guys, man? This is Checking the Faggot. Today we are at a park, parque, it's called Parque Antonio. Um, over here, and as you can see right here to the right is the beach. So I'm just gonna do a little walking tour of this area, show you guys around. So you guys how this place is right quick um now the only problem is this is not the right time of the year to be in peru because it's a little chilly this time of the year it's a little chilly that's why you see me with this light jacket um so if you're if you wanted to come to peru i would say come around they say from december on up it's a good time to come so um, uh from january i'm sorry january february march all that is good so but there's not gonna be a lot of people in the water or anything like that, so we're just gonna do a quick little walking tour and show you guys around the area. Check it out, check it out. Got some people uh, parasailing right here. Okay. Yo, yo, yo. It's a little chilly, but the sun is out. We got beautiful ladies talking. So right over here is where we're gonna go. See that right there? That's where we're gonna go. But that's where I'm gonna go. But I'm taking you guys along with me with the trip, to the trip. I think I should have got some food before I came out here. Man, every time I do vlogs, I'm always hungry. Dang. All right. There we go. We got food right here. So I'm going to check out this food. Now, this is a tour, tourist area. So you're going to see the typical tourists. You know, I got to do tours and as well as locals. So we plan to do a little bit of tours. And then we're also going to do the local spots. So hope you guys enjoy. Let's see what we got here. Yeah, I think I'm gonna sit down and get me some grub right quick. Look at that. So we're gonna work our way. We're gonna work our way down here. Let me grab me some food first. Pretty nice spot. You know what I'm saying? Chill spot. Chill spot going on a little date. Date. Oh, I like these little colorful, colorful things they got going on right here. It's dope. Look at that portrait back there. Now, Chile is known, I mean, um, did I say just Chile? I mean, damn, I hope I wasn't saying Chile all this time. But Peru, um, they have a spot in Peru that has these like sculptures. Shout out to Juan Carlos who showed it to me. They have these sculptures that you can actually see from a plane and they don't know how they don't, it's been there for years and they don't know who made it and it's still there they feel like it's extraterrestrials who probably did them that's a spot that i actually got to go check out i want to go check out that spot and do a vi video Are they dress alike so let's uh let's see what we got over here all right guys you know you got the music playing so because of the music i'm gonna have to turn this off youtube copyright purposes you already know how it is i'm gonna 
gonna try one of these crepes salados. I think I'm gonna try uh, salsa de tomate, tomato, salsa de tomate, queso, oregano. I'm gonna try pollo, lechuga, pollo y queso, champion. Where are you from? Uh, Brazil. Brazil? Yeah. What part of Brazil? Uh, São Paulo. I just came from Brazil. Really? I was, I was not in São Paulo. I was in Rio. Oh, yeah. Where is it? Well, I do YouTube and, oh, really? and also I also travel and enjoy life. Mm -hmm. So I was oh, there. Cool, yeah, I was there for uh, a month, almost a month, mm -hmm. like three weeks. Mm -hmm. And I came back and I came here and then I'm going back for Carnival. So oh, I'm going yeah. to be where you're at. I'm going to be in São Paulo for one week. El Salvador, they said the carnival is amazing. Yeah. So I'm going to go to the carnival over there, and then I'm going to spend the rest of the three weeks in Rio. Oh, that's, yeah, that's bro. cool, man. Yeah. And uh, uh, what about Rio? What do you think about it? I love it. Yeah. It's my first time. Oh, really? Yeah, yeah, well, yeah I know. The beaches there is. Oh, my God. I love it, bro. I did I did all over Rio. Mm -hmm. I, I I even went in the favelas, this favela called really? Digital. <laughs> I went to Hosina. Um, Got it. Uh, I, I, I did the, the night lights, I did the Lapa, Ipanema, all that, man. I had a blast, man. I really enjoyed Brazil. I didn't want to leave, bro. <laughs> I left because I'm coming back for Carnival, so it's like... Oh, uh, yeah. No, it's worth it. Yeah. And yeah. You're, you're going to Salvador, there's an whole set of... Yeah, I'm going to Salvador. Look at these crepes, man. That's pretty dope. It's, like, warm. Look at that. Oh, man. Que bueno. <laughs> Se ve muy rico. Yeah, it's pretty cool. It's warm, but they put ice scoops in there. I'm not in the mood for sweets though. I would get it, but I gotta. I haven't eaten, so you gotta, I gotta eat before I put sweets. So anyway, I got one of these. This thing is actually good, man. Mm. This thing is real good. <laughs> it's crazy because it appears majority of the people here. I'm sorry for smacking. It appears like most of the majority of people here they actually speak English. Like both of the waiters back there actually spoke English. She saw the camera and she was like, Oh you a YouTuber? I was like, Yeah I am. And she was like, Oh, how nice. She asked me what's my name and I gave it to her. Hold on. Alright man, so we just had some food. I feel good now. So now I'm gonna walk down this path and show you guys a little bit of Lima Peru, what it's like. You know what I'm saying? Let me go sit and tell the waiter bye right quick. And we out. I'm show you the video. Hold on. Alright, cut this off. I showed her, I, I showed her I was, that she was on the video. She was like, ah, can I say something? So I'm gonna let her talk. Yeah, let the people from United States thanks or wherever. Thanks to come to Peru and thanks to come uh, uh, our cheese French. I don't know how to say it in English better, but I'm going to speak in Spanish. Venga no beso francés. Please come to cheese. French? Peace oh, French. Beso <laughs> Francesa. It's very delicious and it's been a good experience for Yeah, you. I had a good experience. Bye. Bye. Thank you. <laughs> that was sweet. Ah, pesos. Pesos Francés. French kids. French kids. French kids. Yeah. <laughs> I didn't even know the name of the place. Bye. <laughs> That's really cool people. I didn't even know the name of the place was called French Kiss. That's crazy. Best she was saying it backwards. Besos Frances. French Kiss. So yeah, a lot of people just come out here, man, and they just take pictures. They come out with their little lady. You got little cute dogs and shit.
So now, the, the, this is the plot, right? I haven't been seeing a lot of black Peruvians. So my goal right now is to find out where the black Peruvians are. Obviously it's not gonna be in this video because where I'm at, but there's, a, there's two cities in Lima. Oh, there goes a black one right there. How you doing? Hola, como estas? Hola. All right, there go. Hola. I found the black one. No, no, no. I, uh, so my goal right now is to find out where the black Peruvians are. That's my goal. So I found two cities that actually do it. That, I mean, do it. What do I mean, do it? Two cities that actually have black Peruvians. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to probably try to uh, do some research and find them so then i think that'll be a fire video i mean they might have videos already but i don't know and if they do i don't care i'm still gonna do a video it is what it is ah look at that ah, same igual igualito este es 5k si es igual Sí, tiene 5K también. Ah, es buena. Pero no sé cómo editar 5K. ¿No sabes? Cómo editarlo. ¿Qué, qué tipo de cosas tú usas para editar 5K? No, yo sé cómo poner 5K. Pero cómo editarlo en computadora. Ah, no, eso ya la, la oficina de nosotros se encarga. Ah, eso. ok. Eso lo, lo tomo. Ah, ok, ok. Sí. Ah, pasa bien. Hoy, bye. It was cool. Um, basically, he has a GoPro just like mine, and I was just chit chatting with him, telling him um, I got five. We got 5K in this GoPro, but the editing uh, Final Cut Pro doesn't have anything to uh, export in 5K. So it's like, what's the use of what's the use of recording in 5K if I can't export it in 5K? So I just don't. I don't even put it in 5K. So I don't know which way to go. I'm trying to go down there. Am I supposed to go up here? All right, hold on. Let me pause this thing. <laughs> All right, so I went the wrong way. But you guys still get to see a view. This good for me. You guys still get to see a view. <sighs> you got me breathing heavy now. Yeah. Let's go check out this corner right quick. Okay. So just for the record, over here is so safe, man. Like you can walk with your phone, you can camera. You can do whatever you want over here. You don't have to worry about cameras, problem like that. Because a lot of tourists come here so they they know to, with tours comes cameras and pictures and videos so it's all good i think she's doing a video that's a video <laughs> damn i'm supposed to meet somebody at three o'clock i'm out here messing around with you guys showing y'all videos So we gonna find these beautiful black afro. Hello. She look kind of mad. She look upset. Beautiful black Peruvians. Hay uno que lo ponen así, escucha, verdad, mi Dímelo muchacho, manito. All right. Yo, the thing I like about the new GoPros is um, it it like the the screen cuts off, 
So like you could be recording and someone like, let's just say something happens, you could turn the camera around and show nobody that you're not like, hey, I'm not recording. And if you're recording at night, there won't be any light to show that you're recording. And then all you gotta do is tap the screen and it'll pop up. So that's pretty cool. Let me see if the front screen does it too. Oh, and the front screen does it. That's what's up, man. So no one literally would know I'm recording right now unless I, like, I mean, they, they, they see me with the camera, but they don't see, they don't see any video, no video or anything like that. I mean, no, no picture and no light. So you would not know I'm recording. It's pretty dope. It's pretty dope. She got cakes. I had a hit to make sure I was recording that. Hey, oh, let me get around so homeboy don't get mad. Get on, get on. Alright. Mm, we made it. Ooh. Oh man. This is beautiful. This is look at this. Look at this. It's, she got on suntan lotion too. It's not even no sun out. What's up with these people over here, man? Sun is no like literally there's no sun out, no cat. Like look up, look, there's no sun. And you see people with suntan lotion. You guys saw me the first time I was all the way up there and now we're down here and we still got some more to go Hola. Perfect surfing weather. Now keep in mind, like I said, it's not, it's not, it's not warm. It's like, it's windy. It's not a beach day, put it like that. I know this place probably would be full with people on the actual beach days. They don't got sand, they got rocks. Look, see this guy with his suntan lotion? That's what I'm saying, I don't understand what's up with these suntan lotions. Chivo, no guerra and sufia. Do you like to serve? Oh, thank you. <laughs>
must be their version of Ron John. Surfer, this is where to come at. What is up? What is up? Everywhere I go, I'm, I'm gonna make sure I do a video where you guys gonna see a beauty, a beautiful part of Peru. So we're gonna end it with a bash, and this is what I'm gonna show you, man. This is where a dope spot to come and chill, have drinks, dance with a chick, whatever you want. So I'm gonna just show you guys around, man. I'm gonna let you guys see it from behind right quick. This is where we at. You see it? You see it? See it, keep looking. You see it, you see it. Boom. All right, so now let's turn the camera around. Look at that. This is awesome, man. This is awesome. Wow. Tranquilo, tranquila, chiquita. <laughs> hey, we about to get down in Peru, man. We about to get down in Peru. Oh. So over here you can come and dance salsa, merengue, bachata. They got different spots and it's early. It's not even nighttime yet. So just imagine when night hits. But you got, what is it? What's it called? It's called agua. So, it's called agua. So right there is called agua. Then further up, oh, let me just let you guys see. Vamos a mira agua. You got a bus that'll take you here called Treble Tours VIP. That'll take you here. You got girls popping up out of nowhere, posting up, getting ready to, to, to dance and have a good time. You know, unfortunately I can't be recording too long because I'm about to have a good time, man. I didn't come out here to record too much. Sorry, guys. Wow. This is bonita. Wow. Look at this, man. Hola, brother. This is... Pero que? Dime. Wow. Un poco allá, ven. Y 
Yep. Female. Damn, bro, this is nice. Wow. I can imagine, bro. Like when it comes, like later on, I can imagine, man. This thing is probably so thick. It's early right now. You see, the sun is setting, so it's early. But I can imagine. We gotta come out here and turn up, man. I need some people to come with me to come out here and turn up. I need somebody to come and turn up with me. Necesito alguien que viene, viene para porque estamos on fire. Yo y mi amigo estamos on fire. ¿Qué es lo que tú dices, niño? Wow. Grámame. You see it, man. This thing is looking. This thing is looking super beautiful right here, man. So it's not even about it's not even about where we at. It's the whole scenery. To me, the whole scenery is really dope. It's like I don't know. I can't even explain it. You know what I mean? And look at up top, thing right here. Look, look, look at up top. That's fire. I don't care what y'all say. That's fire, man. That's fire. That's it. It says more money. I think so. Because these are all locals, so I'll let you guys know how much it is, but we're going to keep moving. Esa
hotels. Over there, they have hotels. Okay. Vamos a Cuatro Sol. Cuatro Sol. Ah, gracias. Cuatro Sol. Alright guys, so I showed y'all a little something, man. I'm gonna go inside somewhere. I'm gonna probably catch a little bit of scenes inside and then that's it. But we done. Alright, we out of here.